Bonsoir, Perry. I'm so inspired by all the activists we've heard from tonight, including all of you out there in the crowd. Come on. Come on. And of course, everyone watching from home. Tonight, I join your call to action. Because two years ago, the United States promised to provide 11 billion in international climate aid. America needs to make good on that promise. The United States also needs to step up and use its power to help unlock critical funds held by the World Bank. As many of you know, the United States, think of it as a garden. Every country has a garden. The United States has a deal with the water supplier. They get the most water and other nations need to make absurd deals to get some. They need to pay back in oil, back in timber, in minerals that destroy their soil. The United States has the power to redistribute that water, to acknowledge that historically they have been the ones dictating who gets what and how much. It is their responsibility to step up and free $1 trillion for vulnerable countries whose territories have been damaged by the climate crisis and extractivist industries. This access will help regenerate economies, pay for losses and damages, and strengthen adaptation measures. We cannot stop calling out the big economies. United States, pay back. Earlier tonight, you heard from the president of the World Bank, Ajay Banga. His commitment to the debt pause clause is an amazing first step on the path to change. But now, the, we need the U.S. to step up for further reform of the World Bank. The climate crisis and social injustice are inextricably linked. Our economic system must not only work for the few, but for all nations and for all people, especially communities that are impacted first and worst by the climate crisis. We demand not only action, but transparency and accountability from the governments on their existing commitments. Now is the time for change, and now is the time for real action. We urge each and every one of you to join us in this critical effort, because climate action must be now. We all have a role to play. So get on Global Citizen app and call on the U.S. government. Call on the U.S. government. Call on the U.S. government to do their part. <laughs> 